But firstly, I need you to welcome from the Mandis Eagle Gym, the one like Sabah Ukaj. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, is the one like Richard Keeler from Peru Gym. In the blue corner, we have Sabao Ujkaj from Mandis Eagle Gym versus Richard Kila from Perun Gym in the red corner. Keep your eyes open, this one's going to be a good one. Hello, oh, we're back. Oh, good, we've got a bit of sand, we're back. Oh, that's lovely. Can hear my voice again. Oh, there you go. We've missed it. Well, we're back here, ladies and gentlemen, for our next fight of the evening, which is between two 73 kilogram fighters fighting a C class bout. And we have Richard Kila from Peron Gym in the blue corner versus Sabah Ukaj from Mandis Eagle Gym. And it seems like Richard's come out really determined to start out with. But then Sabah's come out with heavy hands. Very unorthodox style there, David. Where's he going? There's a lot of swings in there. For me, I see a left hook, a right hook on over that shoulder. Good score there with I'm the just, knees. I'm just trying to make, get an understanding of what the blue fighter is trying to get to do. He looks, he looks a bit uncomfortable in there to me. He does. Whether it's nerves, I don't know. Oh, there's a trip yeah, coming, I yeah. think. Good low kick there from the gentleman from Peru. Very well established gym with hard fighters. The facial expression on Sabah is interesting as well, David. I've never seen that before. And the gum shield clearly <laughs> showing what the gum shield to the world. He's on his feet though, he's on his feet. And to be credit to Richard, he's keeping very calm and composed. Good low kick though. Solid teep by Richard. Really interesting style. An orthodox. It's, it's, it's I'm just I'm just bewildered to see what's actually happening to. <laughs> He's just right running around, around the room. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen that before. Shouldn't be laughing to, but I am. I listen. It's I quite. It's see quite what I'm seeing it's right now. Amusing, though. But you know, Richard right now is doing some nice eye-catching work with the boxing. Now, listen, you only can fight with you by fighting you. And right now, Richard's got a very unorthodox kind of fighter. It so looks he's like got he's got solid hands, but yes, there's a lot of swings going. Yes, he's, yes, he's got to do his work. Look yeah. like he's got to do his work. But then Richard should be cutting off the ring rather than chasing yeah, him. It's a very interesting opening round. And all the years I've seen fighting, that's a very interesting opening round. Even the referee said to him about running around there. I've never seen the referee in a, in a fight giving instructions to the fire. <laughs> <laughs> oh, listen, this is, uh, it's entertaining. This is entertaining. On your toes, just take on a whole different oh, yeah. meaning. Oh, wow. But then, to be fair, Richard should be cutting off the ring and not allowing him to do that, to be perfectly fair. 
Richard should be putting a lot more pressure. Yep. Mark's giving him some, some clear instructions right now to yep. put him under pressure. And don't let him move around as much and give him as much time as he can as he's yep. getting right now. He looks a bit unnervy in the, in, in the first really does. Opening round. So hopefully at least feet, you can find his feet. Let's see the nervous well settled. In the second round. Well, the body language says oh. the same again, David. I've never seen someone leave with their chin so high. Well. And the jabs oh. are coming from his chest. Oh. The way he's throwing the punches and everything. Really interesting. Whoa, that was a turn. No, he, he deserved turn. that. He turning turn his body. Back. You can't yeah. turn your back on a foreign your opponent. Referee solid, solid account. kick to the body there from Richard. Sabo so definitely felt that. Let's see how good that conditioning is. Let's see if we can start working now. Richard came out to touch gloves, but Sabo was having none of it. Maybe that kick hurt kid, him so much. The kids, I'm not sure if he's nervous or... or but it seems like this is the way the, he fights, though. Blood's coming from his nose now. He's in a lot of distress. He's in a lot of yeah, distress. I, I don't see this going much further, yeah, do you? No, I can't do it. Not yeah, when he's moving yeah, away he's like that. Called no. it. There you go. As we said, as we both said, as we both called it. Ladies and gentlemen, big round of applause for the fighters, please. And the referee has called an end to the fight. 32 seconds into round number two, with Sabah unable to continue, leaving your winner of this contest. Making your winner of this contest with Seba unable to continue, Richard Keeler at Peru and Jim. But please give a big round of applause to a very game fighter, Seba Utkaj.